Okay, hi. Okay, some of you may have been having problems getting the 4K resolution. Um, on the HDMI 1, I haven't, I will be doing on HDMI 1, uh, and we can then confirm that that works on HDMI 2 and 3. But the basic um, thing we need is uh, now in the background there that is actually the screen the one above the second half is actually my blu-ray player that's why it's got play disc okay and the menu at the bottom is related to the blu-ray player so in the settings here under picture um, most most of them are just set to auto you know it's either auto or off so you obviously want to have your HD on now if you want to get a resolution of 4k now if I press my TV button there's an info one here press the info button as you can see up there 3840 that is 4k okay but it's taken me um it's been fiddly to get to that setting and what the reason is is there seems to be a conflict with uh <coughs> this the hdmi deep color now that is currently set to auto <coughs> which is the right setting. Now I had this with another TV and what I had to do was disable, disable it on the TV. If the TV, which I'll go back to the TV menu now, that's the TV, right, let me go the long way. I just wanted to get the settings open, here we go. So, in special viewing, I've got nothing selected. Not overly impressed with the HDR. It, it kind of makes some pictures look a bit um, over, overdone. It wrong. Expert settings. Here we go. You go down them, and okay, and as you'll see in there. I've got that turned off. If I turn it on, just to sort of show you what's happening. Now if I click info, it's gone down to 1080p. Right. So now it's back. It sort of took, it took, um, it's back. It took the uh, film to sort of kick it back into full 4K. But if I turn that HDMI color on on the TV, when I'm in the film, it will not say 4K. It will default back to 1080p. So it's a bit annoying because now, well it's okay if I can assign it to different HDMI channels, it means I can have the deep colour off for one thing and not another. Now this, uh, yeah, this film I'm playing is a Blu-ray player and it's a Samsung Blu-ray player I'm using.